Right, to have approved the canvas hood on your Rover, you will need a paintbrush, a pair of gloves, some natural creamy beeswax available from Tool Station, about £5. A hair dryer, or I've got a heat gun, it does make it quicker. And I'll show you how you do it. Uh, are you carving? I think right. so. To do it, are you, are you on the thing, yeah. to do it, <laughs> get some of the wax on the brush. I'm just going to paste it on. Really? So the viewers can see. I'm just going to paste it in. You'll see. Better doing it on a warm day. But when it as it cools down, the wax it'll go a white colour. Just work it in. Some people put it on already melted, but I prefer to do it like this. Just rubbing it in. I'll just do this panel quickly. It doesn't take long, as you can see, working it all the way in. This is for uh, canvas hubs that are getting old a bit and are letting water in. that panel done. I'm now going to heat it up with the heat gun so it soaks into the fabric. Keeping the heat gun moving all the while to stop it burning the fabric. And you see it change colour. You see it changing colour there. Keeping it moving all the time so you don't scorch the fabric. That's now soaking into the fabric and making it waterproof. And just do that. You see it melting there. Cleanest way of doing it rather than uh, putting it on hot and get all the fire risks and stuff. And that's it. You do that for the whole of the hood and then it makes it super waterproof. We'll let it cool down. Here's a bit I did earlier, which is the back bit. Put some water. Put the water on. And look how waterproof that is. Right, so, we've just had a quick shower. And it seems to be okay. Not leaking in, let's have a look inside. No, no leaks there, no water. I think the waterproofing has been successful. I did put another coat on the top, I went over it. Uh, and put plenty on on the top, that's where main, obviously the main uh, waterfall will go uh, and it's been great, it has been raining this week and there's nothing in the back at all and uh, for the sake, I think it costs 15 quid altogether and it's all sorted Thank you for watching